Just inviting a few of you. Okay. All right. I can see there's a couple of you here, so we'll get going. This is just a kind of a quick unboxing on this Saturday afternoon. Um, so as you can hopefully tell from the title, um, it's Secret Scent. Uh, this is a box that we do every month. Um, and for those of you who aren't familiar with Secret Scent, it is a monthly um, fragrance subscription um, that lets you discover new designer or celebrity perfumes and aftershaves. Um, so you get a 30 day supply of three different fragrances every month. There's a man's and a women's subscription um, offer uh, or service. So obviously it makes a nice gift as well for um, that man or woman um, that yeah, that's really hard to buy for. So I will get straight into it and then I'll talk to you about the different prices and a discount code. So the box itself is letterbox size, which is great. So obviously you don't necessarily need to be in to receive it. And it looks like this. So really nice um, and compact. So it's great to kind of throw in your bag to take on weekends away and things like that as well. Um, and it's also nice to store jewellery in and things after, the, after you've um, used the fragrances as well. So we'll open it up. It does come in an outer postage box as well, just to protect that one uh, from the elements and things like that. And then there's the theme card on the inside, which obviously shows that this is the July edition. And then usually what happens is there are the actual scent cards themselves, which um, give you a little bit of information about the perfume and about the different fragrance notes that are in there. Um, usually as well, there is, yeah, there's a share and win a £25 Amazon gift card. So all you have to do is take a photo of the box and then post it on Twitter, Facebook or Instagram with the hashtag secret scent box. And there's a winner picked every month. You can win a £25 gift card for Amazon. So it's always worth having a go at that. You've got to be in it to win it. Um, and this is also something they don't always include every month, but I'm assuming this is one of the fragrances this month, but there's a, an introductory offer on a fragrance from Banana Republic um, at Superdrug. So you can get it for £25 rather than 55 but only at Superdrug, and that's only until the 8th of September. So they're the two... Uh, extra cards that come in it and then we have the fragrance cards themselves which coincide with the fragrances so this is how it looks when you take the cards away so you've got your three little fragrance vials kind of encased in kind of like a foam sort of um, padding to stop them from getting damaged and the first one if I can get it out is Versace Bright Crystal uh, and then there's the, the fragrance card there. So what it does is it shows you the full size bottle there. So if you do like it, you know, when you go into a shop, you kind of know the sort of bottle that you're looking for. What it also does is it tells you a little bit about the fragrance and the different fragrance notes. So again, if you end up liking this fragrance, you can look for fragrances with similar ingredients in as well. So it says, Versace Bright Crystal, a precious jewel of rare beauty characterized by a fresh floral and vibrant fragrance, perfect for those summer evenings. So it has top notes of yuzu, pomegranate and water, uh, middle notes of lotus, peony and magnolia and base notes of amber, musk and mahogany. So let's have a little sniff if I can get the lid off. There we go. That's really fruity on first sniff, but I've kind of said before, I like kind of musky, um, sort of almost masculine scent sometimes. Um, Vanilla is one of my favourite fragrance notes. Uh, this, so this has amber and musk in it. So I'm betting when it settles down, it'll be exactly the sort of fragrance that I like. Not that I'm against fruity fragrances per se. Definitely very summery, that one. So then the next one, if I can get it out. There we go. Is from the Banana Republic. And it is Peony and Peppercorn. So let's pop that down and then that's a picture of the actual bottle and then obviously there's some information here so I'll just read that out to you. So it says introducing a beautiful brand new eau de parfum by Banana Republic, a spicy floral scent crafted by perfumer Vincent Kuczynski. 
um, and it has top notes of pink peppercorn and fresh bergamot. It has middle notes of pink peony and rose petal and base notes of skin musk and cashmere wood. So let's have a little sniff. So that's quite floral, at least on first sniff. I've, I've kind of said this um, before, um, floral fragrances for me aren't my favourite, mainly because I have hay fever. Um, so a lot of the time floral fragrances can kind of uh, set me off on a bit of a sneezing fit, but that's not too bad. Um, it's not overpowering or strong. And obviously it has the kind of um, musk and cashmere wood base notes that so probably dies down quite a bit anyway. Um, but I'll de definitely on first note, it's quite, quite first sniff, it's quite florally. And then the last one is Cartier Eau de Concentre. And then we have the picture there of the full size bottle. It looks very posh. And then the information is a clean and light fragrance from Cartier created by perfumer Christine Nagel. The perfect scent for those summer days and evenings. So it has top notes of coriander, violet and lavender. Middle notes of violet again and base notes of amber, patchouli and cedar or cedar depending on how you say it. So again let's have a quick sniff of this. So again quite floral on first sniff. I'm not normally a massive fan of lavender but if it's not kind of the main scent then it's not too bad. But yeah, obviously with it being summer, a lot of fragrances are going to be quite floral because it's, it's that sort of season for it. Um, and it says it's got amber uh, and, and cedar again in the base notes. So it probably dies down to more of a musky scent, which is more my kind of thing. Um, but obviously fragrance reacts very differently to everybody's skin. So a fragrance that might smell very nice um, to one person may not smell nice to another person. It reacts to, you know, our pheromones and things like that. Um, so, you know, what I think may be completely different to what you think and my favourite may be totally different to yours. So, I'll go through the prices and then I'll quickly recap on everything. So, it's the same price points for both the women's and the men's subscription. Um, so, it's £15 a month if you want to just pay monthly or as a one-off. Um, if you want to pay for six months worth, it's £84. And for a full year, it's £156. Um, that all comes with free delivery and we do have a discount code which is box session 50 and that gets you your first box for half price so £7.50. Um, they only ever use 100% authentic fragrances um, so you can be rest assured that they've not got any kind of fakes in there which could contain absolutely anything. So again just a quick recap when I can get the first file out there we go. So the first one was Versace Bright Crystal and then there was Banana Republic Peony and Peppercorn and lastly Cartier Eau de Concentre in the July edition. Um, obviously my review as always will be up on the blog in the next week or so. Obviously I'll share it on the page and in the group uh, so you can have a read of it. Uh, again, the discount code is box session 50. Um, it doesn't matter if that's in block capitals or not. I think they've set it so that it accepts it either way. Um, and that gets you first box for £7.50. Any questions, as always, pop them in the comments. I'll be putting the, um, the discount code in there as well. Uh, and this will be uploaded to YouTube very shortly as well. So that's everything. Um, and have a nice Saturday and hopefully I'll see you very soon for another unboxing. Bye.